Hi, I'm Jenny Houston. My business is called Edge Only. So for me, with starting Edge Only, I knew that I wanted to create jewellery that was in the luxury space, but that was also a bit more edgy, a little more rock and roll. My background had been working in RT as a broadcaster, so for me to switch from being a DJ and a presenter into being a businesswoman, I needed to upskill, and the first thing I did was go to the local enterprise office and sign up for a Start Your Own Business course. Um, and that was great just to kind of get an overview of what I should be doing and also to kind of quickly realize maybe where my weak spots were. And I kind of took advantage. I took every course that they had going. I think I did taxation, digital marketing, websites for small to medium sized businesses, selling to the USA. And what I loved about it is that you could just sign up for loads of them at a really inexpensive rate. I think most of the courses were about 40 euro and you could do it either on the weekends or in the evenings which suited me. So. From Start Your Own Business, I then went on to the Business Network and I also availed of a feasibility study which really helped me early on when we were creating master models for our men's and women's collections and all the moulding and prototyping that needed to be done. Um, so that was a huge support. Um, and then from that I joined the Women's Network which I think for me one of the one of the really brilliant things about the, the Women's Network and just networks in general is uh, being able to, in a really relaxed atmosphere, become more confident speaking about your business and telling people what they do and learning things like elevator pitches and all these things that become really commonplace when you're in the world of entrepreneurs but aren't maybe very normal when you've come from working nine to five or from you know a full-time job. So I found that great and all the little tips that I learned throughout the different speakers, whether it was on search engine optimization or one or two things on Google AdWords. So small tips, but also the social side of it and the, the support you get from meeting other people in business that are like-minded. One of the things that was really important to me when I was setting up Edge Only is that I really wanted it to be made in Ireland and uh, a big part of Edge Only is ethical luxury. I really believe in you know, where your products are made, who made your products and knowing those things. So for me, keeping it in Ireland um, and keeping this, anything that I couldn't get done in Ireland or wasn't cost effective to do in Ireland for, or from a skill base to keep it in Europe. We sell predominantly to creative professionals, you know, whether it's 25 to 45 at core, but it's men and women that um, are individuals that like to be stylish, that like to have a bit of personality in the way that they dress or what they wear. So when we're all wearing a black dress, we're all wearing a grey suit, the only way to stand out often is through your accessories, and whether it's a tie or cufflinks or a lapel pin or something a little bit flamboyant. And I think nowadays it's nice to have something that's a conversation starter. So with the lightning bolt, some people go, oh, David Bowie, other people say, Harry Potter. You know, and for me, I wanted jewelry that was really well made, hallmarked in Ireland, but that also had a bit of personality. So we started in London, and then we have some retail in Dublin and Sligo, and we've just sent our stock over to New York, which is exciting.